So far, whenever you have added a route link, you have made sure that the link exists. But that is not always the case because users might try to navigate to URLs that do not exist. So instead of showing them an empty page, you can show them a 404 page. On this part, you'll learn how to create a 404 page component and set it up in the route configuration. So whenever users navigate to a link that do not exist, they are automatically redirected to that 404 page. So let's go to Visual Studio Code and see it in action. In here, the first thing that I'll do is that I'll create a new component. So for that, in the components folder, I'll just right click and then open an integrated terminal. And then I'll type ngg generate a component. And the name of the component is going to be not found. So the component was created successfully. And you can see that in the app.module.ts, you can see that the not found component has already been added to the declarations array. I'll just cut it from here and put it up here because down here we only have the pipes. Just copy this one and paste it up here as well. And in the pipe section, we're just going to have the profit pipe, which is a custom pipe that we have created in one of the previous parts. Now let us go to the app.route.ts and in here, at the end, I'll just add, let's see, 404 page for non-existing URLs. So now in here, let us define another object. For that, on the path in here, I'll define two asterisks. So I'll just define here first asterisk and then the second one. Now this indicates to Angular that this route definition is a wild card route. So for the component property. Now, let's just define that whenever any of the URLs above is not matched, we want to load the not found component. Now, if we go to the not found component, so we have the HTML file in here. Let's just go to the HTML. In here, we can just create a div, a div and have a class rule and then div in here, another div with call MD12. And then let's have in here an H1 tag, which is going to be, oops, an H2 tag, which says for found. Now you can be creative in here. You can create any not found page that you want, but this is going to be simple enough for me just to see if it works or not. Here on the app route, we have an error. Let's see what the error is. And that's related to the missing comma up here. So I'll just add the comma. You can see now full link. I'll just save the changes. Let's go to the app. And now let's see if I go in here to a page that does not exist. For example, very this and then press enter. You'll see that you are redirected to this page, which says, oops, and then 404 not found. Let's click the home. We are redirected to the home 